Hello and thank you for your interest in BEC Assemble It, a new document assembly tool from BEC Legal Systems. This first video in our series provides an overview of Assemble It functionality and demonstrates how it improves and simplifies producing documents in Microsoft Word. Assemble It makes it extremely easy to find and insert the standard content you use all the time. That's because Assemble It content is located right here in Word's task pane. Watch as I select a piece of content, otherwise known as a clause, read what it says in the preview pane, and if it is the one I need, double-click to add it to my document. I can insert content clauses selectively and in any order. As you can see, the inserted clause maintains its format as it is inserted into a document. This is true of text, as well as tables, graphics, even photographs. In addition, clauses know if they belong in the document header or footer. This one is a footer. You might be wondering how easy it is to save content. Watch as I add this new paragraph to my existing clause library. It's simple. I select the entire piece of text, click the Create Clause button, name the clause, and click OK. Now it is a permanent part of my clause library and available for insertion in any document whenever I need it. Assemble It content is organized into clause libraries. A clause library is a set of content pieces logically grouped together. If there is a specific type of document I draft all the time, I can set it as my default clause library and automatically open it whenever I begin a new document in Word, as I have just done. This is a contractor services agreement, a document I use every day, and it is currently set as my default. Some of the clauses in this agreement include variable data, which is highlighted by an orange font. Assemblet has features to handle the variable data, which will be explained in the next video in this series. This list displays my current selection of clause libraries. There is no limit to the number of clause libraries available to a user. Also, clause libraries can be publicly available to all users, or they can be private, created and maintained by anyone for personal use. I also have a favorites list, which displays the clause libraries I use most often. Assemblet is very versatile and can be used for all types of documents, both legal and otherwise. For example, here at BEC Legal Systems, we use it to produce our software release notifications and other marketing documents. I hope this video has been helpful in explaining the basics of Assemblet. There is a lot to learn about Assemblet, including how variable data can be pulled in from a specific client matter, and the way clause libraries can be further automated with question and answer scripts. For more information, please contact us at BEC Legal Systems. And thank you very much for your interest in Assemblet. <laughs>